Hey Sagittarius, welcome back to the channel. My name is Nali, a.k.a. Awotero, and I'm here to give you guys your weekend love reading. We're going to tap into this energy, see what's going on with you guys this weekend. We're going to see what are your overall messages and the possible outcomes. But before we get started, guys, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click that notification bell. It allows me to connect with you energetically, and it definitely helps me out with the growth of the channel. As you all know, my readings are timeless general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. Time is fluid, so whenever you find this reading, you are meant to hear it. If the reading resonating, you would like additional messages and clarity regarding your situation, you can always book a personal reading with me. The info is in the description box below. And as always, I want to thank each and every one of you for all your love and support. It is truly appreciated. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and get started. Let's pull out your messages for the weekend. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel Guides, and Guardians, overall messages for my Sagittarius, please. Alrighty. So the first card that I got out here was unappreciated. I felt like you didn't care. Reciprocity. I want to have an equal give and take and gossip. I'm afraid of what other people will think. So there's an energy here. Um, your person felt like they were being unappreciated in the connection. Okay. All they wanted was an equal give and take, okay? They wanted an equal give and take here with you. They wanted to make the connection work. But with this gossip here, I feel that there was interference from friends or family members causing you and your person a lot of instability, a lot of insecurities, and may have played a big part in the separation. Um, people were probably telling your person, oh, um, Sagittarius is very selfish. Sagittarius is only out to take care of themselves. Sagittarius doesn't give a shit about you, blah, blah, blah. And this is where this person started getting this energy of feeling unappreciated. All they really want is to have a balanced connection with you. This person, I feel, does want to come back towards you. Because at the bottom of the deck, I have soul tie. I always feel you... I always feel connected to you so this person feels like you're always in their energy they're always thinking about you they see a lot of synchronicities there's a constant reminder about you this person's overall energy and intentions this weekend is to be able to come back towards you and balance something out here with you an equal give and take here and regardless to the gossip and regardless to the bullshit if you've been getting some messages from other people telling you that this person has moved on or they're up to something else you're being told that not to listen to the gossip as it is a bunch of lies so let's see here universe archangels spirit angel guides and guardians what is the overall energy with sagittarius and their person here overall energy with sagittarius and the person please Overall energy with the person on Sagittarius is my universe. The two of wands, okay? So the overall energy between you and this person right now, Sagittarius, blockages are being removed, okay? Blockages are being removed. Your paths are being open. I feel that there's this energy of you and this person finding your way back towards each other, figuring out how to communicate with each other, and finally opening up those lines of communication. What else, universe? Yep, with the seven of cups in the reverse, no more confusion, no more um animosity, no more interference. Um, I also feel that both you and this person have realized that the people around you guys were causing all these problems, were causing all this drama, and you both are in this energy where you just want to release this drama and the and the gossip already. Overall energy here. With the Four of Cups here, you both are missing each other like crazy. And I'm talking crazy here with the Strength and the Four of Cups. You both are in this overwhelming energy where you're constantly thinking about each other. Constantly wondering what the other one is doing. How's the other one doing? Did they go to lunch? Did they do this? Did they do that? Did they go here? Did they go there? It's a constant reminder of what the other person is doing here. And I feel that you and this person are in this energy where you're on... Honestly, always seeing a lot of synchronicities and feeling like the other person is around you, okay? Um, with the Four of Cups here as well, it's also not wanting to miss an opportunity in this situation and wanting to take the connection in a different direction. What is this person's overall intentions with my Sagittarius universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians? Page of Wands. This person's intentions is to come towards you and communicate. They will be opening up the lines of communication here with you. With the Four of Swords, after a while of no communication, resting, rejuvenating, and healing, this person is wanting to bring this connection in from isolation. 
for a possible reunion with the Page of Cups for an, a possible offer here. I feel that you and this person, again, you both have been thinking about each other constantly. Now more than ever, especially as we're getting closer to the holidays, is where we start being nostalgic and thinking about, oh, how our past Christmases were with our ex and blah, blah, blah. And this time around, it's like you guys are more heavily into each other's energy. Really wondering what the other one is up to. With this Page of Wands, I see messages coming through. I see this person making that making that um taking that leap of faith making that 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 offer extending that message communicating with you with the seven of swords here this person doesn't have an intention to run away from this connection anymore okay i feel that they have gotten to this energy where they may have resolved some personal issues and now they're really in this energy where they want to resolve this situation with you what is the outcome here between Sagittarius and this person? Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. Outcome, please. What the fuck? Hierophant. Getting back into a higher level commitment. Bringing back the union. Bringing back the relationship. And finally, really putting the work in this connection. Outcome, please, for Sagittarius and this person. With the King of Pentacles. Damn, you and this person, when you guys come back around, after this time of no communication, of really working on yourselves, of really doing what you have to do, I feel that this person is coming in strong. King of Pentacles, Hierophant energy coming in strong. I just seen that king, that Pentacle in this in this King's hands as an engagement ring. Okay, so this person is coming in here strong. They want this connection with you. This is divine intervention. Okay. Uh, again, like I told you, after a time alone, after trying to balance things out, this person's coming in here for reunion and reconciliation, and they're not having it. They're not having anything but that. They want to be reunited with you. They want to be back into a higher level commitment with you. I feel that this person in this time of separation has really reflected on their past errors has really reflected on what they did to you in the past. And now they're coming in here with explanations and they're coming in here with gifts and hands. I feel that this person's coming in making major, major offers. It's like they want to talk to you. They want to bring, bring some clarity to the situation. And they're also wanting to tell you, hey, I want to reunite. Can we move in together? Can we get married? Can, this is what I want to do with you. I want to take this connection to a higher level commitment. This person is coming in here with major, major life changes, major epiphanies and they're wanting to bring in peace harmony and balance and restore this connection once again with you this person wants reunion and reconciliation and they're they're not having anything else but that that's exactly what they want and that's exactly what they're gonna get what are the final messages here for my sagittarius universe this person's coming in strong sag coming in strong Final messages for my Sagittarius, please free yourself. Okay, so I feel that this person has been working on freeing some negativity, on freeing some gossip, on, on letting go of people, places, and things that no longer serve them a purpose because at the end of the day, this person sees you as their soulmate. They see you as their soulmate. With heart-to-heart -heart conversations, this person wants to sit down and converse with you and they want to have a very important conversation. They want to open up and they want to tell you truly how they feel about you, what they want to happen in this connection, and how they want to move forward with you in this connection. This person's coming in with offers, okay? And I'm talking about marriage offers. I'm not talking about those rinky dink oh let's date again offers no no this person wants you to have their last name offers okay all right guys i hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed please don't forget to like share subscribe click that notification bell and if you want to book a personal reading the info is in the description box below i'll talk to you guys soon take care bye